Well, it's a lovely day for it. It takes more than a bit of cold to stop me maidening my Vulcan. Look at this. This is ice. That's how cold it is. Never mind. Let's get on with it. Right, well, here we are up at the field. And it's time to take a chance, even though it's freezing cold, about four degrees, ice on the ponds, to have a go with my little Vulcan, whatever you want to call it. Now, for some reason, I just put a beeper in it in case I lose it as it's a maiden and for some reason the beeper's going because I think I put it on the wrong channel but I, I haven't, can't get it out now so I'm going to do it. Wish me luck. The other problem I've got is with an Elevon mix that I've got I can't seem to give it some up trim when I throw it so I'm going to try a three quarters throttle and I'll try a left hand throw so wish me luck. Here we go. Now I'm going to do a right hand throw. I'm going to throw high right hand. And my fingers are still rather close to that prop. Right. That's the idea of that bit at the back is so you can throw it without getting your fingers in the way. Let's see what happens. Oh, straight into the ground. Definitely need some up trim. But like I say, the problem is up trim in Elevon wicks, as I've just tried, doesn't actually work which is a bit of a problem for me. Let's try it again. Well, I've given it maximum up trim there. And it's still diving like... I think it might be a bit nose heavy. Right, well, I've got a little tiny bit of lead in the nose just to make sure it wasn't going to be tail heavy. I'll take that out. We give it another go. Right, well I've taken out the lead. Let's try it again. And I've given it some up trim, but the problem that's done is it's reduced the rates even more. That's kind of, I've got to find a way to do up trim. Let's try again. A good throw up. Oh, almost, almost flying level. Why does it need so much up trim? Maybe that nose that I've put on thinking it would be a, a nice thing to do is actually, because of the shape of it, maybe the nose is actually causing it to go down. Right, now out of desperation here, I'm going to actually bend these a little bit. It's the only way, any way I can get some real up trim. up a bit more. That's up a bit more. The trouble is now it might climb too much. Let's give it a go. Almost. I didn't get my hand on the elevator quickly enough. Good thing about this long grass is though you get soft landings. This time it's going to work. And I've got it on high rates because otherwise I don't think I'll have any authority. Damn me, it flies! Damn me, it flies well. And it glides nicely. It glides nicely, it flies nicely, but it does need a lot of up trim. So now I know it flies, I'll give it another throw. Oh. You can see how much up trim I've had to put on by bending the control arms. But basically, I didn't even have to trim that left or right. That was going so well. Yes, let's have another go. One of my friends said the tail skid wouldn't last long. Well, it's lasted, lasted that long anyway. Right, everything's still working. Let's just check. 
yep still working I hate hand launching because you don't get time to get control <laughs> That was better, just about got control there. So that's full throttle. Quite quick, but not climbing like crazy. This is three quarters. That's almost hands off. Oh, what a joy to fly. I don't think there's enough power there to loop. Full throttle. No, it won't quite put its nose high enough to loop. What about if I... No, it just stalls. But it stalls nicely. Half throttle, it will just cruise around beautifully for a landing into the sun there. I'll give it a bit more throttle. Well that motor is very small, it does need a bit of a bigger motor but three quarters throttle. Well that was a bit risky, oh man, got away with that. Anyway, my little Vulcan flies, I'm going to come in and land now. Oh, beautiful, beautiful landing. Oh, yes, just such a lovely glide. But anyway, um, success. I know a lot of you like to see a maiden. I didn't disappoint you this time, and thanks for watching. So if you've enjoyed this, I don't know if you see my hand there, which side it is, but don't forget to hit subscribe. If you're locked down like me, then take a look at my channel. Lots of stuff on there to keep you amused. But thanks for watching, catch you all later, and stay safe.